I am going to tell you the harrowing true life story of how my mullet caused me to get in a car accident one day. So starting sometime, I would say in 1988, <laughs> through maybe 1990, I had a mullet. And, um, and I loved my mullet. Oh, I, I love, I almost hit my, I almost hit my, I almost hit my boss. <laughs> well, my boss's car. She decided to back up as I was uh, pulling out of the driveway. <laughs> so, uh, anyway, um, so I really like this mullet. I mean, like, it was long enough at one point where I could whip my hair, whip my hair back and forth and it would hit me in the face. That's how long it was. And at one point I had a perm in it. I'm telling you, buddy, I was cool. Anyway, so, so one day I'm in the car and I think I'm in Cedar Rapids, Iowa and I'm at a stoplight and uh, you know, that car had a moonroof, it had the windows down, it was summer, I was feeling pretty, you know, hot, I'm pretty sure is the right term for how I was feeling. And uh, so, so I'm, I'm checking my mullet, I'm checking to see how good I look uh, in the rear view mirror, and out of the corner of my eye, I see the, I see the, the, the stoplight turn green. So, like an idiot, because I'm distracted by my beautiful mullet, uh, I don't even look. I just like let off, let off the brake and start to go, and bam, hit the car in front of me. <laughs> oh, what an idiot! Anyway, so now fortunately I wasn't going very fast. I mean, I don't know if there was even any damage, um, but uh, but anyway, um, yeah. Anyway, so that's how my mullet got me into an accident, and let's face it, it's how my vanity got me into an accident. And it's funny how short a span it's been from that pretty young man to this fat old guy. But I wouldn't change any of it, I don't think. Okay, thanks for watching. Love you.